To install the watercolor system, open the zip folder and extract all the files in your preferred directory. Once all the files are extracted, drag and drop the install.mail file into the Maya viewport. This script will link the system folder to Maya, adding the directories to the Maya environment file. It will also change some background settings to run the system, so you will be prompted to restart Maya. After restarting Maya, you should see a new shelf called WC. All the tools required to use and manipulate the watercolor system can be found in this shelf. To quickly test if the installation was successful, click on the blue sphere tool. This will create the default test sphere and load all the watercolor renderer automatically. To open the test scene, make sure to first set your project right. Go to File, Set Projects, navigate to the watercolor system folder and set it to Projects. Now that the project is set, you can open the test scene under File, Open Scene and select fruitplate.ma. Once a scene is loaded, you might find that all the objects are shown as green. This happens because the scene was created on another computer and the file paths to the object space shaders are not the same anymore. To fix this automatically for all objects, right-click on the Prep tool and choose Refresh Shaders.